was poppin'. Brand new whip just hopped in. I got options. I can pass that. What's poppin' T Squad? It's me, Keisha, and I am here with a new behind the scenes T video. I drop videos Monday through Sunday. Everything that I say is for entertainment purposes only and alleged. So if that works for you, then let's get into this video. Okay, you guys, so you know that I have been giving you all the behind the scenes tea on the upcoming season of Married to Medicine. They are heading into season 10 and we have heard that there will be a major cast shakeup during season 10 that some of your faves, our faves might not be returning. We've also heard that Phaedra might be added to the cast and I have been rooting for and championing and cheering for Dr. Gregory, Quad's ex-husband and his new fiance to return to the show in season 10 because I think that that would be a huge cast shakeup and I would love to see it. Well, T-Squad, we might be getting our prayers answer today dr heavenly posted this picture of she and dr g's fiance her name is Letitia, and she captioned having brunch with a new friend at sweet underscore t underscore s h h a and she um put hashtag dr heavenly hashtag married to med hashtag dr heavenly university dot Come. And I was like, okay, she's spending time with Dr. Gre Gregory's fiance. I wonder how Quad would feel about that, you know, considering they're really close friends. And why would she be hanging with her if they weren't filming together? Because if y'all not filming together, then why are you hanging out with my ex-husband's new boo thing? Like, I got an issue with that when we supposed to be friends. So it's given me very much they filmed having lunch together or something. I want to know what that is about. So what's going on and even with if they are filming for the show if I was quiet I would still feel some type of way low key you know what I'm saying would y'all feel some type of way y'all let me know but Letitia has not only been kicking it with Dr. Heavenly she's also really good friends with the Whitmore five days ago this photograph was posted on Simone's Instagram of Simone and Cecil Dr. Gregory and Letitia, who are in the middle, and I don't know who that other couple is. Um, oh, their name, uh, the guy's name is Aaron, and the girl's name is She Styles 3404. Don't know if they'll be on this show or not. Maybe they're a new couple on the show. I don't know. But Dr. Simone captioned this photo, a night of fun and SHIT talking, hashtag married to medicine, hashtag get ready, hashtag tf hashtag hashtag just when you thought now all of those hashtags are giving me very much y'all get ready because these are the new couples that are going to be on the show that is very much what this is giving me i think that this shakeup is going to be phenomenal i want to see how quad is going to react to her ex and his new boo being a part of the show getting married will they get along how will it work with her being around Dr. Gregory? How will it work with her being around his fiance in group settings, on cash trips? That would have to be very awkward and weird. Maybe she'll shock us all and come into it, you know, with a positive attitude. <laughs> Who's to say? Who knows? But just in case Letitia is joining the cast let's get to know her a little bit better so tanisha is in fact a twin she has a twin sister by the name of kanisha so it's Letitia and kanisha and she is an auntie she has a beautiful nephew i don't know if this is the twin sister's child or if they have another sibling but she does have a nephew and she is a twin that's super cute she's also a united states air force vet okay girl you're gonna be in the next top gun movie all right she know how to fire planes or do whatever they do in the air force all right and she's a veteran okay girl i don't know what she's doing now for a living but she is very well traveled if you go on her instagram 
program. She has been to Colorado, Paris, Dubai, New York, Maryland, Washington, Texas, um, so many, New York, so many different places. She is bi-coastal, I guess, meaning um, she's from Texas. She's a Texas gal to the DMV to ATL. I guess those are all the places that she has lived. She also likes to do makeup. Here's one of the looks that she has posted. You know, this is cute. This is from quite a while ago. So maybe her skills have gotten better. You know, hopefully this is not what she does for a living, but it's cute. It's really cute for like a beginner's look. But thus far, I'm really liking what I'm seeing about um, Miss Tanisha. If um, she is going to be a part of season 10, at least she'll have her sister, you know, as backup maybe to film with her. Um, as of right now, the only two married to medicine wives that are following her are Dr. Heavenly and Dr. Whitmore, Dr. Simone. So I don't know what y'all think about this. Does this give you that she and Dr. Gregor will be joining the cast? It's what it's given to me. And I would think that Bravo would be absolute idiots not to join them in and have them play in the mud for season 10 because the awkwardness alone <laughs> is gonna be great to witness do you think that um, I can see them having a one-on-one -on -one lunch her and quad um I can see quad having a one-on-one -on -one with Dr. Gregory you know the group events oh my goodness gracious Oh my stars. And y'all know Kwai got a mouth on her and she's slick at the mouth. Um, I can just see this going so left. <laughs> so left. Like this is juice. And then on top of that, if Phaedra does join the cast with her new boo thing, oh my God, the dynamics there will be fireworks, honey. Yes, ma'am. Now I have heard a little bit of rumblings allegedly that Contessa and Anila were let go. Don't know how true that is. If anybody I can see them letting go, it would be Anila maybe. Um, but I would be kind of low key, a little shocked if they got rid of Contessa. Uh, but you never know. You never know. They are, they are shaking things up over there at Bravo and anybody is dispensable and can go at this point. And we're going into season 10. I do think that it's time to shake up the cast. I mean, if anybody out of that cast that needs to go is Dr. Jackie, because Jackie don't do nothing. Groot does absolutely nothing. She has no storyline. All she does every season, ever since her and uh, Big Country had their affair scandal, ever since then, she has used the show as nothing but a tool to promote her businesses, which is great. But other than that, she has had no other storyline outside of getting into it with Simone. And we're sick of that and we're over it. And they're back, you know, cool at this point. So yeah, if anybody needs to go, it needs to be Dr. Jackie. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this bit of tea down below in the comment section, you guys. Make sure to thumbs up this video, like and subscribe and hit that notification bell button. I love you guys and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.